Good morning. I'm Steve Gunnels, uh, working on the GMT project. This is an outer mirror cover uh, working model at uh, 112 scale. The way this uh, system works is we have four folding panels that are interconnected with piano hinges and connected to the back of the mirror cell with a piano hinge. And the combination of the four cells being hinged in this way, these two synchronizing arms, and track rollers or cam rollers at the ends of this hinge line running in these guide tracks defines that the mirror cover opens and closes with a single rotary actuator at the back of the system, which is uh, shown in red. Inside the uh, mirror cell here, we see uh, an exact uh, scale uh, model of uh, the Stewart Mirror Lab mirror. I've cut the edge of the mirror away so that you can see the honeycomb structure. It's a very, very elegant uh, structure and mirror system. And uh, so we go back closed and uh, the reverse of the original process occurs. And now the mirror cover starts expanding and uh, eventually will come down and, and close on the mirror cell, which is here. And there's a seal here to keep dust and dirt out. This man is exact uh, 12 scale, uh, 6 feet high at, at 12 scale, so he's an exact uh, scale person next to the mirror cell. And that's the way it works. Here we see a back view with the rotary actuator uh, pulling on this link to pull the mirror cover open. So a single rotary actuator will cause this entire uh, folding and unfolding uh, operation to occur to get the mirror cover uh, clear of the mirror so that the incoming light beam can get to the mirror and the telescope can uh, do an observation. And that's fully open.